Hey everybody, Mr. Nolaxim here, and we're starting a cool new game, Life is Strange. Uh, it's a little bit hipstery, but you know, it's kind of like the Telltale games where you get to player choices have a huge impact, and I like those games, so, and it, it's pretty cool. Uh, it kind of deals with some heavy themes, um, so just telling you now this game's rated M for mature, it's not really suitable for kids. I hope you watch, just, you know, warning again, things get kind of heavy. Let's get started here. Life is Strange is a story-based game that features player choice. The consequences of all your game, in-game actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. Read that kind of fast because I thought it might disappear fast. It didn't. Uh oh, there's a storm. This is scary, guys. I was wrong. It was. It's a scary game. Maybe I don't even know. Rain drops keep falling on my head. I'm lying there and I hope that I'm not dead. I'm not dead. I can't be dead. The game's just started. But I'm getting all wet. Oh man. I got freckles. What's happening? Um, is this lost? Am I freckles from lost? Kate, was that her name? I don't think you. I'm not trapped in a storm. I'm not like sucked up into a tornado. Wait, there's the lighthouse. I'll be safe if I can make it there. Okay, let's head there then. Please let me make it there. Okay, I'm assuming that this game's play style-wise is gonna be very similar to Wolf Among Us, Game of Thrones, Walking Dead. You know. I don't want to go that way. I want to go to the lighthouse. My hair does look like plastic, but it also looks wet. At least it did until I said that. It's kind of hard to tell now. But, oh wow, that is a bad storm. Maybe she was right. I like the graphics in this game. It kind of... I don't know. It's nice. Um, it's a little cartoony, kind of reminds me of Wind Waker a bit. Um, maybe just the tornado, but I don't know, it's a lot better than Wind Waker. I don't know, I like it. Watch your mouth, girl. But yeah. Yeah, I agree with her there. That's a bad storm. Oh no, it's, it's taking the houses. Oh. That is not good. Oh. That was so surreal. Okay. called film little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography as he likely was. Okay. Okay. I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. That was weird. Light to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Okay. Now, well, she's can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black I didn't fall asleep and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Okay. Weird. Diane Did he just say Bueller? <laughs> there you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Oh. Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those okay. sad mothers and children. Oh. She saw humanity as torture, um, right? Um. And frankly, it's bullshit. I don't. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. Okay. Seriously, though, I could frame How any do one I... of you in a dark corner and capture you. Uh, in a it's not working. And any one of you could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? Oh. Too obvious? What if Arbus chose to capture people at the height? That's what I'm doing. She had a brilliant eye. So she could have taken another approach. It doesn't go any further than that. Fan of her work. I prefer Robert Frank. Me too, Victoria. He captured the essence of trying America. And there was honesty about the economic conditions of the air. It's honestly but not working. Struggle. You don't have beauty without a beat. Which explains beauty why Frank was Kerouac's photographic muse. And both were okay. the great chroniclers of the 1950s. Well, we've all seen mm. that iconic shot of Kerouac on the balcony. And if you haven't, shame, shame. No, shame, After shame the on you. romantic urban solitude of the 20th century I was an English major, you and you're pretentious. Now... Contrast Frank's stark Americana with uh, Salvador Dali's surrealist okay. photographs. 
Like Cocteau, he was a true I am doing person. exactly what it's telling me to do. Are famous. Early examples that of that drag truly towards awful look. word you pesky kids Maybe. love so much. You have got to be kidding me. Seriously. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. You, you've... <sighs> Selfie, okay. You have got to be kidding me. I did go and move towards the word. Look. There was an arrow. It was telling me to drag my arrow down to the picture. You all saw that. You all saw that. And it's a great tradition, and I wholeheartedly fight for your right to self-expression. Um, or selfie-expression. Journal bag. <laughs> Sorry. Let's I look, I guess. So I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. Yeah, you look like but a third person. I like it old school. Okay. I do love my analog camera. I should take a quick picture now. We might. Now... Based on the chapters, I have no doubt. I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Oh, actual let's process look at my bag. That led to the birth of the self -portrait. My little camera bag is battered, but still mm. kicking. Kicking like a chicken. If anybody else yeah. looked at this, what would they think? Um, I'm not gonna read through all of this with you guys. Um, October first, October, my favorite month, the best weather of the year. I love watching the leaves change color, turning into tiny flames. Okay, I'm not gonna... You can pause and read it if you want. Okay. So we gotta take a selfie. With a big old camera. Okay. Just jump r shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. Uh-oh. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max... Oh, great. Why did I of do course, that during as class? You all know the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Yeah. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Did so he really? I couldn't resist. I don't like the him. The point He's remains that the portrait has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as okay. long as it's been around. Loser. Now, Max. Loser. Since you've captured our interest okay. and clearly want to join the conversation, Great. can you please? Tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits. Um. You're asking me? I don't know. You're asking me? L let me think. Okay. Um, you either know this or not, Max. Don't Is be a there jerk. there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French okay. painter who created daguerreotypes. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Who cares? Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Okay. Very good, Victoria. The Daguerrean process... That was really lame. ...detailing people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s on. Okay. The first American Daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. Boop, boop. You can find out all about him in your textbook or even... Okay. ...online. Finally. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. Yeah, I'll fly okay. out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. I don't it's great really exposure care. and you can start a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, okay. don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Whatever. I don't care. Hey, look, someone left a notebook and a tablet. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. I know. Even her school books are gift wrapped. Okay. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? She's probably 12. And laughed. Did they did? Of course. I don't recall Victoria that. Victoria has to have the bestest, newest, most. Let's I use. I should have known. She'll have better equipment okay. than Blackwell. Okay. Okay, can I do anything here? Okay. Blah, blah, blah. It shoots what you want, where you want. And it's expensive. That was... Hey. Computer. Let's use computer. Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. Um. Okay. Why do I even get a look at that if there's nothing I can do? Hey, Kate. Hi, Kate. Oh. Hi, Max. What's up? 
Why would I embarrass her? You seem um, quiet today. What's Just wrong? thinking too much. You okay? Let's go hang I out. I hear that. Wanna go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Thanks, Do you? but not today. Oh. I have to go over homework. No worries. Let's hang later. Sure. She doesn't want to. Well, let's photograph them. Sure. Uh-oh, somebody in Amber forever. I don't really care about you two. I guess let's look at the picture. You can never escape the lighthouse here. Uh oh, just like that intro scene thing. Oop. I really Even don't like that. The forest around here always looks mysterious. The little circle and the dragging thing. Oh man, freak out. Oh, the tornado's back. I don't know, I don't man, like that very much. Man, the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. Okay, it's just TV. Let's look at her. Oh, Every time okay. I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Let's interrupt just to, you know. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson. Interrupt can I them. Talk to you for a moment? I don't have anything yes. to say. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. Oh. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Okay. Um, do I have to? Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. It's really not. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, Whatever I know means. it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you. She doesn't Life look won't 18. wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, okay. blah, blah, right? Sure, but you whatever. do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision mm -hmm. it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. I don't That's know. what separates the artist from the amateur. Max kind of looks like 15 or something to me. I didn't turn anything in. What was the point of that? Whoa. Okay. Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. Tell me he about it. He probably paid 20 grand for that camera. I bet he gets pristine mm. digital images. I bet he paid more but than that. I still that. take my little instant camera. I bet, you know, he paid extra just to be pretentious about it. Welcome to the real world. Okay. Then I might send you a special picture Okay, that was... Are those guys making out? Not that that's a problem. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. Um, I don't know if splashing water on your face will make you look like you're not a loser. It might make you look like you're crying. Walking down the hall, listening to copyright music that I can't play. Cause of copyright now I'm down in the hall and... Life is strange. So one chrysalis. Let's pull the fire alarm. No, we won't. Let's talk to them. They're popular, but let's not, cause I don't have any friends. Missing girl. Amber. She's thinking a lot, it's kinda sad. Here's the description of Amber. Jumping through the cut, there's some people texting down in the hall. Let's look at them with a brown jacket and Alyssa. Evan's not a very nice guy, but he's a... Ow, that girl just bumped right into me. She saw me there. She's real rude. There's my locker with my mom and my dad and... Jack Kerouac and Andy Warhol. Good looking Andy. Okay, well. Dana is a cheerleader. They're bullying that nice looking guy. 
but I don't mean hot. He looks like a nice geek boy. I hope we're friends. Let's beat up Logan. Yeah, let's beat up Logan. He's a stupid bully boy. That's Brooke. She is really into Warren, my best friend. I don't even know if we're best friends. Missing girl again. Amber. There's a lot of posters about her. But. Halloween party. I wish October would last forever. Oh yeah. Let's get some snacks, but we're not gonna. I don't have any change, I don't think. But let's save Arcadia Bay. Because over the past decade, climate change has altered the Oregon coast life. It's pronounced... Yeah. Pronounced Oregon. It's not Oregon. Trust me, I know I was born there. So don't say Oregon. It's Oregon, you guys. Oregon. Seriously, Oregon. Okay, but anyways, that's Juliet. She's in the Vortex Club. And she's flying with Zachary. He's a jock. But... Oh, yeah. Samuel's a weird janitor. I thought I liked him, but later in the game, he's really weird and kind of suspect. I don't know if he's a good guy or a bad guy, but there is Miss Grant. She seems nice. She, I'm not gonna tell you any spoilers, but hey, she teaches science. I don't know if I'm good at science. Seriously, this copywritten song goes on so long. Hey, you just bumped into me. Is this the way to the bathroom? Cause I gotta go and wash my face in that order. Hopefully, I'll wash all my hands. But now, okay. Okay, well, finally. <sighs> you got that copyright done with. Um, let's look in the mirror. I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. It all started okay. with a bizarro dream in class. Am I going crazy? If I go crazy, will you still call me Superman? Let's look at the poster. The last time I got a flu shot, I got uh. the flu. Fuck you. Yeah, I don't get flu shots either. So... Oh, that's now, nice. Now, who bother to write that crap? Probably Victoria. She's got a secret, I bet. Hey, <laughs> Get it? That wasn't funny. Okay, that was... A waste of time. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Who's it from? Santa? Fuck it. Oh... Okay, well... When the door closes, uh, a window opens. Or something like that. Did I just see the Illuminati symbol? Okay, girl, you don't uh. get a photo op like this every day. Why is there a butterfly in the bathroom? Ah, uh, Kanye was in here. Butterfly. Butterfly. Let's take a photograph. That's a weird photo. Butterfly in a bucket, but okay. Watch. What's he doing in here? What in the world? It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. What Just in the world? Come to three. Why is he in the women's bathroom? You own this school. If I wanted, what? I could blow it up. You're the boss. Like a boss. So what do you want? This I is... hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Um... Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You okay. got hella cash. What That's is... my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. What's going on here? I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. Okay. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, um, I can see the headlines now. She's Leave blackmailing them, them out of this bitch. I guess. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little okay. girl and talks to himself. 
You don't know who the fuck I am. Oh, no, he has a gun. Language. Jane, he's Nathan. What are you doing? Got a gun. Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what okay. to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. Don't say you anything. You're in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody yeah. would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from um, me, psycho! Oh. Oh, oh man. This is not good. Um, Whoa. I just reversed time. What the fuck? 